is called Wikipedia Bootcamp in Taiwan, the experience of Taiwan writing camp for tutorialing new editors. Uh, so please welcome Dennis Ray Lang Chen. Hello everybody, it's very a pressure to be here with you guys. And before I start my start my lecture, I want to know how many people are from China, Mina China. Do you please raise your hand? Wow, that's quite a big one. And from Taiwan how many people are from Taiwan? Yeah, I'm from Taiwan too. And how many people are from the locals? Hong Kong or Marco? Oh. And my, the title of my section is Wikipedia for Camps in Taiwan Experience of Taipei Writing Camp for Tutoring uh, New Editors. And this is one of the group photo of one of our, we take after our meetup. And I'm Dennis. My ID, user ID is SuperTex, and English is SuperTex TW. Uh, I'm currently the Secretary of Wikimedia Taiwan. And I have been involved with the other project, like the OpenStreetMap, a mapper in Taiwan, very, very active. And I'm very, very interested in the open data. So I'm the general open data movement in Taiwan. Let me introduce, uh, before I start talking about the bootcamp, I'll introduce you to the Wikimedia Taiwan. We were established before 2007, Wikimania. And currently, we are uh, running Wikidata Small Man Taiwan competitions. And we have projects, another project like the local wikis and education project. And of course, the uh, writing bootcamps. Uh, so one of the uh, pre lunch uh, uh, string shot of our Wiki Loves More Men Taiwan website. And the uh, button down photo is uh, one of the recruitment portal. We're talking about, uh, we're recruiting volunteers to join us, join the working force behind Wiki Loves More Men. And this is uh, some group uh, photo of Taipei community meetups. We have about weekly meetups in Taipei. And we have uh, we host several seasonal meetups in Taiwan. Sometimes we will hold in Taipei, mostly in Taipei, and sometimes in Taichung or other city like Tainan. Okay, uh, let's uh, try to improve the uh, the gain of Taipei Writing Camp. Is the, we have to talk about the Wikimania 2007. Uh, we have uh, uh, regular meetups, but you know, uh, we have. Uh, Break between Wikimania 2007 and and uh, regular Taipei meetups. After uh, Wikimania 2007, there's no meetups hold in Taiwan. Everybody who, who is uh, one of the organizer behind the Wikimania 2007, they're burned out, so they decided they want to rest for a while. And then the rest time is uh, probably two years, three years. There are definitely no meetups around Taiwan. Okay, finally we have a meetup in 2011. It's a good story. After we had a holding in 2007, we had a family meetup. This seems no problem at all, but it didn't work fine in Taipei. But someone uh, who attends the meetups, well, we were WikiLeaks. They want to put some stuff on the Wikipedia, so ask for permission. Okay, uh, here's a lot of the, one of the one day uh, one of our meetups. The first one is uh, they were talking about redesigning of the Chinese Wikipedia front page, and one of the uh, attendees said, "Which is should be user friendly. Everybody can see what's going on, what to uh, what to click on." But uh, we have a survey that day. 
uh, most attendees who are readers don't go in through the front page. They just probably Google it and then go into that page. Then they have read, uh, read it all, and then they are close it. They won't go, in, go to the front page. And the second topic is the date and topic of summer meet us. We have decided where to hold it and the topic of the meetups. Okay. Uh, the third one is uh, we have to claim that we claim that WikiLeaks is not part of Wikipedia. And we're talking, and the final one is uh, we're talking about the possible of uh, uh, wiki clubs in in school of Taiwan. So we have a lot of topics. So the first problem is that we're talking about too much in our meetups. And we have uh, we have, can't decide what to do. We just keep talking. And this is one of our problem. It's hard to control what the attendees will talk about. They, they probably want to uh, want to know how to edit Wikipedia, but we're discussing about what's happening on the pro, uh, community board. Who's fighting with other admin or who's blocked by someone else? That kind of a topic. And the newcomers can't can know uh, can learn how to edit by these meetups in Taipei. And finally, uh, these uh, regular meetups can recruit more contribution to Wikipedia. And we, and we think that's a serious problem in our meetups. And uh, for potential contributors, they're very, very curious about Wikipedia. Sometimes, uh, although they sometimes mis misunderstand that we are Wikileaks, but they're still very curious about us. They want to know what's Wikipedia. So maybe they saw the promotion banner on the top of the website. They came here. But they can't get into what's going on on the meetups. And, so, and some, sometimes we miss someone that they want to learn how to edit Wikipedia. But we can't get them these answers. So once they show up, we never, never expect they will come up come here again. And that's a very, 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 very big problem. And uh, the situation in Taiwan is quite different compared to in the mainland China. We already have a lot of people, many people, that know about Wikipedia already in Taiwan. It's quite different than China that we have to, have to go in through the Great War fire, Great fire War. And this is some of the misunderstanding of the people we met in the meetups. Like someone asked permission to put their stuff on the Wikipedia. They thought they were, we have to, they have to get permission from us and then put it on the website. And someone, and sometimes someone wants us to help them edit things. And uh, for my personal option, it's quite annoying to answer these uh, uh, these questions. <laughs> and it's very, very uh, oh, and for the active contributors that we saw and uh, with a web page of the editing history on with Chinese Wikipedia, they usually won't show up in meetups. So we just have to keep a core probably. Uh, four to six core members that will show up in the meetups, but no more. We can't expect the more experienced editor will show up in these meetups. So there's a question that's raised in our heart. Why we should hold meetups? So one is, uh, some will put, uh, maybe we will make friends for this meetup, learn how to edit with media, learn more knowledge, and let more people know about Wikipedia. But we decide, we have to decide what, what to do. So we have to change. The ordinary meetups in Taipei are just talking, talking, talking. We should change to do something more, more aggregate promotion plan. So we decide that what we should do. 
the first one we should do is uh, improving the quality and quantity of Wikimedia and try to recruit more editors to contribute and keep new contributors, let them keep editing and train them to edit. So we decide maybe it's a good idea to incubate contributor by the community. So we decide we should split the meetups. The, we should have a regular meetups for community members and a total meetups for newbies to teach them how to edit, edit uh, Wikipedia. So we expect that tutoring meetups should act as a help desk for newbies. Okay, so we start the writing book camps in se September 2011. And we have hosted uh, 20 times. And the time we hold this meetup is uh, every second Saturday. So we choose a cafe, uh, have a Wi-Fi connection cafe, to, to hold this writing boot camps. Okay, there's a three steps that we're going through the writing boot camps. The first one is the, we have a sign up page for the newbies. Before they go into the writing boot camps, they'll sign up at the box on the, this page. You can saw it, there's a, there's a input box and after the date, you should uh, type the ID of the attendees. And this page has the where should the newbies go and where is it hold. When is it hold? And this is the page of the, uh, the about us. And the second one is uh, when the, we hold the meetups, the everybody should report what's going on. Uh, last month. They'll report what, uh, what they write about. So they'll have a, uh, at the sign up page, they'll not only type their IDs, they'll type what they're going to, what they have already write, written and composed. Like there's uh, somebody uh, with a J-C-H-O-B-A-N-A-N-A, he's uh, writing about the California art college. And after everybody said what they have edited, the, first, the final phrase is the triggering tag. If somebody has some, uh, some question about how to edit Wikipedia and how to find reliable resource, uh, reference, they can ask the, the more experienced editor there. Yeah. Or have another question they can ask on this section. And this is one of the portal, of, I think it's uh, probably uh, the uh, uh, July, yeah, the most recent one, recent, uh, recent uh, writing book camp in Taipei. And here you might wonder about what's the logo of the right down bottom corner. It's the logo of a writing book camps. It stands for, there's a Chinese character. It stands for the, it's the aberration of the Taipei city. And the puzzle is, uh, oh, I have a, <laughs> there's some, uh, there's some words is missing. The puzzle is for the, the small contribution of knowledge on Wikipedia. And the plus symbol is, the, it stands for the keep it in the proven of Wikipedia. Pen stands for writing stuff. And maybe someone is curious about what's the difference between uh, Taipei Writing Book Hands and Edison. And here's the, uh, I have three, three mm, points. The first one is in Writing Book Hands, the hosts uh, usually won't provide reference. If somebody wants to edit in, we, we will ask them to bring their own reference to the writing book camps. And the second one is uh, we usually hold the book camps in coffee shop with Wi-Fi. But uh, we still want to collaborate with culture institutions. 
but we're still trying on. And here's something uh, we are still, some problem we're facing. Like the one I previously mentioned is the, the active user editors in Taiwan usually won't show up in meetups. They might be afraid to uh, train up with uh, dealing with a uh, uh, person, uh, dealing with person. And it is hard to find a proper in a space for discussion editing. We usually um, choose a cafe with we feel, but sometimes the, the, the cafe owner is not happy with us because we have bring a lot of laptops to the coffee shop and have to have to use a lot, many power plugs. Yeah. And then once once they have uh, charge us for this power plug. And we're not very, very happy about it. And, and we can't establish connection between glams and yeah. So we are lacking proper reference to support editing. We can have we haven't had have any connection um, with libraries, or or like a museum, like the one on the show slideshow of uh, present the Metro Pass Museum. They're quite uh, I think they're quite um, not very very happy with, with Wikipedia because a lot of a photo of the exhibition is on the Wikipedia side, and we. We should need uh, needs to translate more education booklets to traditional Chinese. This like this one, welcome to Wikipedia. I think it's very very good to explain to newcomers, newbies, what's the concept behind the Wikipedia and how to edit it. Okay, uh, it's quite. A, uh, I just talk about ten minutes, so maybe we can have more and more questions about what's about the writing book camps. Uh, thank you very much. So anybody has uh, any question? Oh, what's up? this culture institution. And another uh, aspect, in Taiwan, the culture institution is usually owned by the government. So it's uh, very, very hard for them to accept the concept about free culture, the concept of free culture. So we have uh, some hard time to get in touch with them. Visual uh, talk room on online, so we keep not only the meetups and uh, keep on the the talking discussion on the virtual space, like the like the Skype. We have a Skype uh, uh, chat room that we can keep discussing something we haven't finished yet on the meetups. That's one. Before. Uh, the method we choose is to uh, let the new newbies become the editors. So we are trying to, if they're uh, interested in, in Wikipedia, and we, and we think that the, when somebody show up at the writing book camps, they're potential contributors. So we just uh, put some something on them, to try to teach them, be not afraid about the user uh, UI of the editors, 
and then and then we'll keep discussion about what they're going on because they're maybe they're facing something like some admin or someone on the Wikipedia have desired to delete their pages. So we we uh, so we keep so we talk we discuss about with, with these editors and then uh, tutor them how to deal with this kind of tough stuff they face. This week. have some plan going on with the college. Uh, there's a property, and I think it's April, the, the writing meetups in April. There's a professional show up because there, he's a teacher that teaching chemistry at the university. And he has an assignment for writing articles on Wikipedia. But this is, this is a uh, supplement uh, assignment for students. But these students are trying to edit they have a problem because they you usually don't understand what's the concept of Wikipedia. So it's uh, the final result usually uh, getting deleted or the IP is abandoned. So it's a, it's a good opportunity for us uh, to help the teacher. So we have a, a collaborator with this teacher. Maybe it's a, we have a start a, a class with this chemistry teacher. And for the second uh, question is, there's a lot of students that uh, exchange to Taiwan. So we have to meet someone that is uh, already a Wikipedia or Wikipedia editor or a user of Wikipedia that show up in the meetups. And then I think it's a, it's a what do you say? Uh, we haven't had a lot of many, many contributions from this kind of student because most of our members in the Taipei community are not in the, they are already uh, leave the school. So it's, uh, we have tried, but uh, we haven't had many resources to do this kind of thing. Yeah. Is there anyone else that wants to ask something? find some uh, some professional to the center for education to that the Wikipedia if he's a uh, very very active one one uh, discipline like chemistry or biological maybe we, we will certify him for for the that that discipline yeah, that's uh, but we're still going on and we're currently running very, we're very busy because the Wikipedia is moment competition You can ask not only the bookend or the about the community situation in Taiwan.
because uh, foundation staff I joined our seasonal meetups. Yeah. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, anybody have any question? Like the like maybe the comparison between Taiwan and the Chinese community. Yes, please. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I think uh, yesterday there's a Chinese Wikipedia meetups, and we have a, a Taiwanese Wikipedia, Hong Kong uh, Hong Kong Wikipedia, Marco Wikipedia, and the mainland China Wikipedia. And it's quite a different stories behind these uh, communities because for the ta uh, for the mainland Chinas, they have faced uh, a problem that uh, they can't assess the Wikipedia anymore. So they're still struggling to to struggle struggling to access the Wikipedia and let more people to join or know about the Wikipedia. So their the strategy of promotion is let more many let more people to know about Wikipedia. And for the Taiwan, Taiwanese community, we have already have a many, many readers of Wikipedia. So it's the, we have to step to the next stage that the, the promotion strategy for us is to let more, more active users in the community. And for the community of Mako, that they have to have a struggle to keep the community active. They have, uh, in 2009, there's a Chinese Wikipedia uh, meetups called in Macau. But after that, the, act, the, current, the remaining uh, community members are declining because they are, maybe they are uh, their former family or they leave the school. So they have, they have to struggle to recruit more active readers. And in Hong Kong, we already saw that they have a, a good relationship with the, uh, the international community and that they have hold this Wikimania this year. So they already have a lot of um, many uh, representation. And I think they're, 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 the main focus for them is the, trying to recruit more editors. And maybe uh, I think there's the next section that is led by the Dirk Chen and uh, uh, Andrew Lee will talk about the the situation in Hong Kong community. So uh, I think it's probably time to to change to the next section. Or maybe I should. Uh, is there anyone have any question? Louder. You mean to bring uh, more comparison between? Mm, uh, So, uh, 